Hello everyone, Sigler here, Bork Bork. Uh, today I'm gonna show you a farm that I'm, uh, I've uh, tried for uh, one hour now, and just to see the results. Uh, this is a um, raw gold farm, uh, uh, combined with skinning if you want to. And I have skinning on my hunter. So it's uh, this spot over here, where you kill this, uh, I don't know how you pronounce it, Wyrn? Wyrn? Or whatever <laughs> but yeah those and uh, yeah we uh, we've been there for an hour uh, we came to a total of uh, uh, like 12 gold an hour uh, to be fair though it's actually lower than that um, and the reason is because I actually got a glowing green talisman which goes for around eight gold on auction house but the thing is like um, I got four greens this uh, this um, hour so if you're lucky with the with the actual drops you can get like all the uh, if you're very lucky you can get some previous gear in the season of discovery you can't like the uh, what is it the arcane damage the agility the power the fiery the shadow the uh, nature like all of those you, you you have a chance to get them so and you're getting heavy leather at the same time and the trash is not that that bad actually because it's like uh, they drop this bright eyed ball so one stack they, they stack in five so one stack goes for 10 silver uh, almost 11 so there's always something and that's just raw gold there so yeah we got Okay, this one is not legit though because I sold a lot of other stuff. But uh, we got uh, what is that? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, around sixty-five silver in uh, just raw gold uh, from that one hour, and we got uh, sixty-one medium leather. Got some medium hide. We got a supply, uh, well light supplies, a uh, silver bar. Um, we got 19 heavy leather. We got the talisman. I got lucky to get the spirit, fire starter, and a. Where's the last one? Oh, yeah, the a spirit uh, staff. And yeah, I also got a sharp claw. That, that might not have been from those, though. But. Um, I highly recommend that you um, you have mining on it as well because there's actually a few mining spots there. Um, they have a chance to go all the way up to mithril and gold um, at that place over here in Thousand Needles. And there's also an escort quest here that gives some gold and reputation with Thunder Bluff. And yeah, let me just say that uh, this, like, I mean, hunters are freaking broken. I like my gear is so bad, and I still like pump. <laughs> it's kind of funny, but what I liked about this farm as well is like, if you would like to go there for a very long time, there is actually a vendor here, right here, right next to the hyper gizmo quest or whatever it is called, hyper cap. Capat City Gizmo. Yeah, that quest. So there's actually a food and drink vendor here, so you can actually buy some uh, mana pot, uh, some mana, uh, this sweet nectar here. So yeah, I'm, uh, uh, if you want to like grind your way to level 40 later in the Season of Discovery Phase 2, I would highly recommend to go here and see if there's anyone there because they're level 30, up to level 31. So you can you can be there to like 34, 35. And the faster you kill them, the more raw gold you have. And the like medium leather and heavy leather, they're gonna be like worth more uh, once the release uh, of phase two comes out because not as many people are gonna do them uh, okay that's actually not true though uh, if they actually drop here but either way it, it 
I kind of was a. I thought it was kind of of a shield farm. Um, you have to be careful though, because the highest ones are level thirty one. So be careful, because you can body pull a lot. And my pet died a couple of times, so I had to run out and reset. But yeah, it's a it's a bit of a shorter video, but it's there. I uh, hope you like this video, and I see you in the future in the next video. Bork bork.